Good day and welcome everyone. It wouldn't be wrong to say that Indian football is on a virtual high. First, it was the triumph against Lebanon in the Hero Intercontinental Cup, followed by a gritty win against higher ranked Kuwait to clinch the SAF Championship. Of course, the consequent ripple was breaking in at number 99 in the FIFA World Rankings. Fortunately, the hard work must go on if India are to hope for some more glory days ahead. Next on the list for the Igor Stimak led side will be the Asian Games in Hangzhou in China from September 20th, followed by the King's Cup in Thailand also in September and then the Medeka tournament in Malaysia. Then we also have the AFC Asian Cup and the World Cup qualifiers. With us in the studio are two stalwarts who are rich in such international experience. One is from Kepe and the other from Nuve. But both today an integral part of a totally revamped looking FC Goa setup as the 10th edition of the Indian Super League beckons. A warm and hearty welcome to Seriton Fernandez and Roland Borges. Welcome to the studios and thank you for making the time in being with us. Thank you. Thank you. Let's start with you, Sereton. I'll just introduce you so the people come to know what you are. You are the older one in the club in FC Goa. You hold the distinction of being the most capped footballer with 108 appearances across all competitions for FC Goa. In the ISL, you have clocked 9,527 minutes on the field across 110 matches. Hailing from Kepe, Seriton made his debut with FC Goa in 2017. He was an instant hit going by the fact that he featured in 19 of the 20 matches played by the Gauss. The next season was even better as he missed out on just 21 minutes of action in the entire campaign as FC Goa ended runners-up. During the 219 season, young Sariton figured in all the games as the Gaur clinched their first silverware, the ISL Super Cup. Sariton was a crucial part of the FC Goa side that wrapped up their campaign as table toppers in the 2020 season thereby becoming the first ISL team to lift the league winner's shield and qualifying for the AFC Champions League. Known for his speedy runs on the right flank, Seriton was picked up for the India team at the 2021 SAF Championship. But definitely among the special moments was when FC Goa won the 2021 Durand Cup thus making him the most successful players at the club. Welcome, Sariton. Thank you. Now coming to Rolin, one of the latest additions to the FC Goa squad. This boy from Nuve returns home to Goa after having won the hero Indian Super League once, the league winner shield twice in the last three years alone. You so far has 33 appearances for the national team and counting. Rowland started playing for Sporting Club de Goa for four seasons from 2012 to 2016. He had to wait till the third edition of the ISL for his first test of action with Northeast United. He next moved for a short period to East Bengal before returning to the Highlanders for the following season. The next two years saw Rowland emerge as one of the best midfielders in the league while helping Northeast United to their first ever playoff appearance in 2019. He then shifted to Mumbai City, 
with whom he lifted the Hero ISL League Winner's Shield twice. He also picked up the ISL Trophy in 2021 and played in the AFC Champions League and the following year. And now it's back home to where you belong, Rolin. I mean, since we are at it, Rolin, honestly, how eager are you to return to Goa and to play for this club? You know, what's so special? Actually, I can't wait to wear the jersey and go on the field and uh, uh, show people what I've got. Uh, starting from Durand Cup, especially. Uh, just uh, working, uh, working hard day by day so that I can prove that uh, I belong here. I belong to the people of Goa and just can't wait to wear the jersey and go on the field and show my talent. Oh, that's lovely. Uh, Seriton, on the other hand, you are the one with uh, the experience. You know what the team is all about. Uh, and I'm sure all the other players look up to you because you're like more the father figure, so to say. Uh, how is this season going to be different for you personally? Mm, for me, this year is very good because we signed very good players like Rohin, like Udanta, Sandesh. They played for national team. I think this year we have a very good squad. I think we will do better this year. And I hope we can win the both the trophies, Shield as well as ISL yeah. trophy. Let's see what we have. Selton, you personally, you've been through a lot of you know ups and downs, highs and lows. It normally happens with any players. Yeah. Um, how, how do you think you've sort of coped up with all that, put that behind in the past? And you know now you're ready to give everything. You know you can do better. What I want to know is how much better. How much better can you do for FC Goa? Uh, I am always there to support my team whenever whenever they need me. So I want to play every matches, and I have to win the ISL trophy. My main motto is to win the ISL trophy because. In, in Goa, everyone wants to win ISL trophy, ISL trophy. So, in my mind also, I want to win the ISL trophy. Good. That's a good uh, objective to have. Roland, you are a well-traveled player now. You've been all over. You've seen football all over. Uh, what do you think is that one quality in you? that can help this team? Because you know now what the team is. You've been with them for the past few days. What do you think is that one quality in you that can sort of help the team? I think uh, uh, I have a lot of energy uh, to move uh, up and down. I think uh, if I keep doing that, I think I can help the team with that. But also, it's not about a single player. I think it's a team game. So I think if we have to win both uh, both the trophies, I think the each and every player is very important. Even the coaches and every the every player, every uh, uh, the each person in the team is very important. Uh, starting from the measure to the physios to the coaches and especially the players who who people see uh, on the field but i think all the team as a team every every person is important for winning uh, the trophies uh, fc goa has done some good business yeah <laughs> this year they have brought in i mean so far i think there are nine players who have come in five are domestic players yeah. four are foreign yeah. players i mean and you have a new coach yes. they call him the don yes. you know manolo <laughs> uh, where do you think you fit into his scheme of thing? If you were to think from his point of view, where do you think he would sort of, ah, okay, this is the place for Roland? As I've seen his, uh, like the team, with the team he plays, I think he plays with two number six. So I think uh, as far I, if, uh, from my quality is what I have, I think uh, from his perspective, then the one of the number six will be, be better position for me because he plays with two po uh, number six and uh, so I think one of the number six will be a perfect position for me. And you are ready for that? You of course, of course. Yeah. yeah. 
Zeriton, uh, with your experience that y you have, and you've got for the past six years, you've experienced so many coaches in FC Go. The same structure, in the same setup, and you've got so many coaches. Now, that responsibility will also be on you. What do you think that responsibility will be as far as, like, f seeing from the coach's point of view? Mm, as for me, Manuel is a very good coach. He showed past three years for Hyderabad. Uh, I think even I have to play like how they were playing like Hyderabad, like right wing, right back. Mm. They used to play like every when we are attacking, their right backs are very high. Mm. So he wants to more on attack, on, I think. And defense also, mm. we have to balance. So, in the practice, he showed a lot of things. We have to, we have to think what he, what he is. But if you are going to climb, then you also you have, have to, to run, run back. Run back yeah. yeah, he has shown. But uh, let's see what is happening in the matches. We have to improve ourselves. Rolin, you you got a very unique thing because you've got a perspective of the game that you know you've played with East Bengal. You know, it's like a buffet. You've got this buffet that after being there and seeing things, you've picked up a lot of things along the way that adds on to your experience and your perspective of the game. Uh, how do you think, or what do you think is the challenge for you? to keep yourself you know motivated during training or during uh, competition i mean there's two different things but how do you think you can keep yourself motivated yeah, there is motivation uh, because it's like uh, i love this game i love to play uh, football i enjoy playing football and uh, i think uh, we got the best job i will say uh, the thing we love the most and uh, uh, we get to play it and we are paid, paid to get <laughs> play play it. So I think we got the best job and what else we want. So we whenever I go on the field I try to enjoy, I try to give my best and, and that's all. That's all there's nothing like that's a do. lovely perspective yeah. to the whole thing. Yeah, get uh, yeah, there's no <laughs> such as motivation of oh, I have to wake up early and go. I love this game, I want to play it. I want to enjoy it, so I'll, I, whenever I go to play, I just go and enjoy. Uh, now we might take questions, both of you can uh, answer these because we've got, since we've earlier already mentioned that we've got some stalwarts in the team. You've got Sandesh, you've got, you know, Udanta, Udanta you know, all these guys, they are big names. Yeah. And then you have the imports who have come in. What is the vibe? between you all, like, you know, what do you all, how do you all interact with these guys? And you mentioned it earlier also, Sariton. Uh, you know, you have the, having these players only makes a difference. Yeah, for me, Sandesh, he's a very good player. And right now, he's the best defender in India. And same, Udanta also a very good player. Rulin also, <laughs> I will say, as a Goan, he played for national team mm -hmm. so long. So having this experienced player in our team, it feels very good for us, like good, good motivation for us. To go ahead, what about you, Roland? What do you think with players like this? Is, uh, is yeah, it like it's all? Uh, it's all. Uh, it's good always uh, that to uh, have a balanced team. Like uh, too much of experience and too much of young is not good. Like uh, in a squad, there is there are. Uh, players who have played at the highest level and there, there, there are players who are coming up also. So I think uh, there is a balanced team. It's a balanced team. I think uh, and uh, that will help us like the uh, the senior players like us. We can learn a lot of things from the juniors and the junior players, you they can learn a lot of things from us uh, as well. So I think it's a balanced team. Would you agree that perhaps this is the best FC squad in the 10 years? Or? <laughs> I think if we if we have to be called best, I think we have to show it on the ground and win the trophy. Oh, that's I nice. Think then only we will be called the best team. That's nice. That's yeah, a good I way think, of uh, looking at it. Because 
without winning anything you can't call us the best oh what are expectations like i'm sure the fc goa management has expectations the crowd has expectations yeah, the yeah, fans yeah. have expectations what what would you term as your expectations since you all are there you're in the you know you all are like part of the army anyone for personally for me uh, for me as a person from a personal point i have to uh, be available for every game selection uh, i have to train at my best and obviously as a team i want to win all the trophies which we participate in uh, and uh, like uh, train at my best th- best way help the team help the uh, junior players uh, from my experience what i have learned mm-hmm. in past few years i can teach them and they can learn from me and of course i can also learn some new things from them also what about you selta mm, my expectation is to win the isl trophy because people of goa they want the isl trophy past 8 9 years they had try so this year we will win the isl trophy that Hopefully. is my yeah nice that's a nice uh, this thing to have um as a team now together your whole squad of players yeah. you know integration is also very much important uh, i'm sure you'll get along very well it's like a family yeah. it's a team of course and when you all are together uh, i'm sure you'll have time to you know fool around yeah. and also that helps in bonding yes. mm-hmm. in a small yeah, chit chat yeah. <laughs> what do you all talk i mean what do you all talk about i mean <laughs> some of the things we talk about is what happens in trainings like we make if we like if we are playing a small headed game and if we win then we if, if suppose my team wins then i it is him if he his team wins then he it is me and then because uh, we also talk to foreigners also like how are they and they, like so that they gel up with us yeah. it's, it's important that everyone is uh, happy everyone is motivated obviously there are some problems like uh, you can't be at the highest uh, at the all top the all the time mm. so we try to make fun of each other and uh, just keep the uh, bonding good and surrounding uh, joyful yeah same same thing same. yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay uh, next we have the 2023 durand cup yeah uh, the first game is on 8th and uh, fc goa in group d uh, you're playing in gauhati uh, you've got shillong lajong no, north east no. united and downtown heroes i mean you, these days you can't go with just mere names of teams yeah, but yeah. i'm sure you've got realistic targets as you'll mentioned earlier yes you'll want to win it yeah. do you think you'll have enough ammunition to win it of course of course there is no doubt about it but uh, to how to win it that is more important uh, we know we can win it we have a good squad but uh, we have to uh, we have to f- be focused we have to uh, if we win uh, like suppose if we win big in the first match we uh, don't have to be all oh, like we have arrived we have to be focused on, in every match and uh, just uh, listen to the coach's tactics that is most important thing because uh, he knows how the uh, team plays and uh, hopefully we, we can play the first few matches the way he wants us to play i think that will be more important and that i think that is the thing which coach wants to mm-hmm. see because the training he have done with us the finally it's a uh, the people will see what training has been done only in the matches true so i think uh, the first match will be a very the important crucial. match yeah the crucial match it always see. is actually. it always yeah. is because it's a new season new coach new mm-hmm. players i think uh, the first match i think if uh, we get a good start i think then the tournament the we will go as far as uh, we know what about you sir no? yeah every match is a uh, very important for us we have to go match by match and we have to focus in the practice what coach is taught us we have to listen from him and that's it we have to go 
Why do you think, why would you think that the Durand Cup is like a, like an appetizer before the main course? <laughs> Uh, I think it's uh, kind of a pre-season for us before the main league starts uh, so that coach can see his system, how he can, the, because uh, I think I played Durant Cup last year, uh, there are a few changes, few tactical, few player changes coaches does in the Durant Cup matches so that he can see the players how good they are mm. how they can play in big games how they can pl perform in the pressure situations so i think it's a you can say like a experiment thing yeah but of course we are going there to win win but i think the coaches get their team in in the matches because they see the players in the the main matches because you get a uh, minutes over there and of course the fitness is also there mm. but i think the coach can get some players uh, time and the players can also get some matches over there we have to play like most of the minutes everyone <coughs> cannot play so coach will um, he will decide he will decide and it's a good preparation for us for the isl it's a uh, preparation and we learn for our mistakes. When we do our mistakes, we have to learn from there. Mm. Obviously, we have to win the Durand Cup, but from there we have to learn. Mm. And then you'll go on to the main, the ISL season. I mean, this is the season, the 10th season. Yeah. Um, I'm sure you all want to make it memorable, both of you, of uh, for yourselves and for the Especially. club and the fans. Uh, how do you all want to make it memorable? Of course, by winning it. But how the, I have said, how we win it, it's more important. Because it's because a long, it's yeah, a, it's long a long ride. Long, it's a marathon. Yeah, it's not a sprint. Especially mm. the national breaks coming in. Yeah. It will be more like uh, there will be breaks in between. So I think. For me personally, we have to take match by match. Each match, if we target like 20 matches will be there, 21, 22 this year. This year will be. Mm -hmm. So I think we have to go by match by match and uh, not focus on the main goal. Obviously the main goal is to win both the trophies. But if you uh, start with from the first match, yes, there will be flaws. And if we take, if we from first match and if we improve, if we try to improve the the next match and the next match and the next match and the next match, I think we will Get have the a, yeah, yeah. I think we will have a very good season if we try and do that. What would you think about Serata? Yeah, for me, um, every match is very important for us. Um, club needs both the trophies. Uh, as well as for me also, <laughs> because I also waiting for last six years. Oh, yeah, six years. <laughs> now we are trying very hard <laughs> to win the ISL trophy. We have a very good coach. We have very good squad. Hopefully, we can win the ISL trophy. Okay. Ata last tak tumka ata gara kore sogli poita astali. Tumka. Think of your, your family, your friends, uh, uh, you know, the supporters. Mm. Would you like to say anything to them? You can tell them in Konkani. Come on. Supporter, I don't know if I support you. Maybe if you have a season start, you don't have a season start. But I support you in AI Stadium. Maybe we can change the game. So the only message from my, from me to the fans will be keep supporting us in a, in a good times as well as in our bad times. And hopefully together we can have a good season this year. Serita? Mm, without fans, we are nothing. Past two years we played in the bubble. So mm. I think they are the most, they are most important in sure. football. I they are like the 12th man. 12th man, yeah. <laughs> so, I would like to say every match they have to come and support us. 
whether we, we lose or win, don't matter. So they have to come in Fatorda to support us. That's the only thing. Anything you would like to say to uh, your family, friends? <laughs> <laughs> I think family is the most important thing for uh, any person. Like if uh, your family is happy, you are happy. Uh, I think uh, that uh, I am really happy and proud that I have I've been born and brought up in the family. So I just want to say thank you from this. Senator, mm -hmm. I am very happy to be here because of my family, my mother and father. Obviously, my father always supported for me. Yeah. And my mother didn't, but... How oh, she is. Yeah, she <laughs> was very strict. Yeah. So, my father always supported me. Uh, I have to thank to my father, as well as my mother also. Nothing else. Thank you so much. <laughs> Sarton, uh, Rowling, it's been an absolute pleasure, really, having you uh, you know, come and spend time with us. Uh, all of us from the studios of CCR TV, we can wish both of you well. You so wish FC Goa the best. I'm sure a lot of fans, supporters, they are waiting to get hold of the main trophy. Of course, the Duran Cup will be like the appetizer, as I said earlier. Best of luck. Thank you. And have a lovely day. God bless you all. Thank you. Thank you. And Thank you. Thank you so Thank much. You.